Good girl. Girl. This is Bella with our week three final recap. Good job, babe. I'm just gonna start off with some play. Yeah, get it. Get it. Whoa. Good job. So we are going to start this week um, by getting the harness on right away. Our harness is already, oh my god, I'm sure you're excited. Our harness is already attached to a leash. So our goal for today is to get some movement with the leash attached. Hi, babe. So get the Velcro on up here. I have cookies ready. I'm going to set those cookies down while I finish getting her buckled. After she's clipped in, I'm gonna just play the flying cookie game with her. Ma'am, get away from your crate. You're not doing that right now. Get it. Yeah, Bella. Oh, good girl. And by playing the flying cookie game, we're just making sure she's comfortable with that leash dragging behind her. Right there, look. Good girl. Bella. Yeah, good job. Bella. Good job, babe. Oh my gosh, you're so excited. After we do a few reps of her dragging the leash, she's comfortable with it. Hey, where are you going? <laughs> I'm going to pick the leash up. Hey, what's this? and have her follow some food lures. Look how good you do at that, love. Yeah, good job. We're gonna switch hands, make sure that she's comfortable walking on both sides. Here you go. Let's go. Uh, Ma'am, follow the food. These puppies love going in their crate. What's this? Good job. Yeah, good girl. Very good job, babe. Bella. Down. Good girl. So I want to practice a few of the foundation behaviors we've been working on this week while she's attached to this leash. Touch. Oh my gosh, you just got so excited. Okay, you ready? Touch. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you love working. You love working and learning. Okay, come over here. <laughs> Bella, sit. That's not a sit. That is. Good girl. Good job, love. All right, we'll get her harness off and we're gonna practice those behaviors off the leash. Make sure with your hand target, you're practicing with both hands. Get it. That way she doesn't start blowing off one hand versus the other. Good girl. The next thing we're gonna work on is step three to our mat. This week with the mat, we really focused on 
um, shaping that down on the mat as well as getting some distance. Go to your mat. Oh, look at you slide right in. Oh, here's two cookies, you're welcome. Um, so getting a few steps away, clicking, coming back and feeding her. Make sure we go in different directions. Uh-oh. Good girl. Almost left her mat, so that tells me she doesn't like me going off to the side just yet. So we'll continue to slowly build that one. Um, so go back to one step off to the side, click and feed. Two steps off to the side, we'll click and feed. And then we'll release you. Okay. Bella, go to your mat. <laughs> You're so cute. Okay. What do you mean? Very good girl. Very good girl. Same idea as taking steps off in different directions. Make sure you release her in different directions so that she's used to leaving and coming back to the mat from different spots. Very good girl. Now you like this one. Okay. Whoa. Speedy. Speedy, speedy. Okay, finally. We'll work on your, your kennel. So for the kennel this week, we are working on loading her inside, which she's good at. Come here, this way. Follow. Kennel. Good girl. Once she's in there, we're gonna close the door. Mind your tail. Good job. And as long as she does fine with us closing that door, we'll click and feed her. And then just take a few steps away. As long as she stays settled, she's not crying, pawing at the kennel, um, we'll come back and click. And then I'm going to feed her inside of her kennel. Slowly coming in with a few more pieces, really um, feeding her for staying in there and staying settled. Okay, and then I'll give her that release cookie. Kettle. Good job, watch your butt. At home, make sure that you guys are going in different directions, not just the one. Um, like I am here, use the space that you have to walk around. And again, as long as she stays settled, she's comfy, she's not crying. I will click, come back and feed you. Okay. Nice. Good girl. Doing great with that. You're doing great with everything, love. Um, we'll take a quick play break while we discuss what we've worked on so far. Good girl. Um, so we got her dressed in her harness. Harness was already attached to a leash. We practiced the flying cookie game so that she could drag the leash and get more comfortable with it. You spoiled it. After that, we picked up the leash. We practiced having her follow the food lure with the leash on, on our right and our left side. Let's not lay in there, babe. Uh, we did some foundation behaviors while attached to the leash. Yeah, good girl. So sits, downs, hand targets. We took the leash off and we practiced those behaviors off the leash as well. My love, we don't need to play in there. Get it. Good girl. Um, we did the next step to our mat. So step three, really getting the down on the mat having her stay in her down on the mat while we got some distance away. Oh, good girl. Um, and then with her crate, 
we had her get in the kennel, shutting the door, and then opening the door without her darting, and then feeding her and releasing her. Hey, my love, get it. Did you hear that cookie? <gasps> What's this? What's this? Yeah, get it. Good job. And the last thing that we're gonna work on today is gonna be reviewing our handling exercises. Um, after we review that, we will introduce, well, continue to introduce the noisy clipper blades. Hi, are you tired? You've worked so hard. Come here. Yeah, good girl. Very good job, Bella. So reviewing our handling, I'll come from this way, it's okay. One hand under, yes. Feed her for that. Yeah. Yeah. One hand under. Add some pressure. Yes, good girl. I'm gonna break out some cheese for you. And what's this? What's this? Got some good stuff. So continue practicing handling of her tail. Yes ears. Yes. The paws. Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh, cheese is amazing. Yes. Right there. same thing but this time with the nail trimmers in our hands. No. Yes. Good girl. Yes. Yes. One piece. That's all. brush this week. We started by just approaching and brushing with the flat side. Yes. Good girl. And then approaching and doing the bristle. Yes. Good job, babe. Get it. Right here. Good job. And then the final new piece that we introduced this week was the noisy clipper blades. So when we do that, I'm going to start the clipper blades behind my back. And then once the noise is on, I'm gonna start dropping a few pieces of food one at a time. Just don't drop them all at once. It won't come off my finger. Um, and then I'll bring them out to the side just to increase the volume of the sound. Very good girl, right there. And then as soon as she's done eating the last piece, I'll turn those off and bring them back out for her to explore if she wants. And then we'll repeat the process. Good girl, look at that. Yeah, good job. Yeah, good girl, Bella. Right here. Good yeah. right there. Good girl. Good job. And that's it. That is our recap for Bella and her week three. Good job, love.